Welcome to our course, of Robot Structural Analysis Professional 2019. For modal and seismic analysis of reinforced concrete structures. This time, we bring you a step-by-step -step course for the designing, modal and seismic analysis of reinforced concrete structures for midsize buildings. During this step-by-step -step course, and requiring of just basic knowledge of robot structural analysis professional, we'll approach the subject of performing the modal and seismic analysis of a reinforced concrete structure. In this case, belonging to a midsize building. And for this purpose, we'll begin by modeling the project from the ground up, so you can clearly observe all the involved steps. From the placement of beams and columns, to the designing of concrete panels and slabs. Moreover, and do the particular design of this model, we'll take a look at the designing of some interesting elements, such as curved panels and waffle slabs. And which at the same time, will allow us to take a closer look at the definition of the structural properties of these type of elements, and which will determine their structural function in the model. And once we have generated all these concrete elements, we'll continue with the assignment of static cases and combinations. As this will subsequently allow us to approach the subject of the designing of the reinforcement steel, for these reinforced concrete elements. To illustrate this, and for ensuring that the design of our slabs is correct, we'll take a look at the resultant deflection maps. And if deemed necessary, perform the adequate changes in the reinforcement and section of the slabs. Until we achieve a safe design. And having completed this particular aspect, we'll next address the designing of the corresponding foundations of our project. That do its particular design, will also allow us to approach the designing of both isolated and continuous foundations. While regarding this type of elements, of curved panels, we'll instead observe how to obtain the reactions across their supports. So and once we have completed the design of our model, and assigned all the static cases, and in preparation for the seismic analysis, we'll continue by performing the modal analysis of the structure. Observing not just the corresponding parameters, but performing multiple analyses, until we achieve the results required by the ruling design code. And worth noting, that this set of steps, will also allow you to understand the process by which this type of analysis, should be performed for any given code. Concluding this analysis, and having obtained satisfactory results, we'll continue by taking care of the seismic analysis. And for which we'll observe not just the necessary configuration steps, but some important criteria that should be taken into consideration. Finally, and in spite of this course focusing on the ACI code, all the tools that we'll observe and configuration steps that we'll perform, can be applied in a very similar way when working with the Eurocode or any code for that matter. Hence, and if your projects mainly focus on this code, you will still find this course to be quite useful. Moreover, and in this regard, and in case you have any doubts, remember that you could always resort to our support center for assistance. So you can begin performing the modal and seismic analysis of your projects, under any design code that you need. See you in our course, of Robot Structural Analysis Professional 2019. For modal and seismic analysis of reinforced concrete structures.